Here we are in the clock room of St Anne's Stamford Hill. Davo. What do you mean Stamford Hill? That's what the church was called. It might be called Stamford It was St Anne's Stamford Hill. Up there, that's Muffle. So the bells on there ring off. Muffle. Look at this. I'm going to show my sister Anne this. Look at this. Uh, Peel. Oh, uh, no. Yeah. 5,040 Stedman Triples. There's Dad. Uh, what else is there? William Theobald. Umpy, as they called. Hang on. Am I recording? Well, don't, you haven't told me. Well, this is the belfry of St Anne's Stamford Hill. As you can see, this is the second bell. My dad had this in 1957. Notice, can you see there? Ernest J. Rowe. That's my dad's name, cast into the bell. And uh, you'll hear it. Anyway, do you wanna, Dave? Do you wanna stop recording? I'll come up a ladder. So here we are. There's eight bells here. That's a treble bell. Second. My dad hung these. Third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, and a tenor. And here's Dave Reed. Say hello to the viewers. Hello, everybody. So, want to say hello to Ellen? Old, old uh, Steve Rose in his element in the bell tower at St. Anne's Church. Who would have believed we'd been up here, Dave? I don't know. Mate. Absolutely nobody. It's the first time I've ever been up here. Well, there you go. 70 years. It's worth coming up here, isn't it, eh? So, uh, what I'm going to go down, do now, is I'm going to go down and ring this bell up. So Dave doesn't know, when I ring this bell up, this bell will be upside down. It will stop upside down. And I can turn it one way and the other. What? And that's how you change ringing. That's how these are change ringing bells. So how about we go down? Dave? Hello, everybody. You can smile. Yeah, <laughs> Yeah. Do you reckon old Woody like this? He's in his element. Yeah, this would burn well, wouldn't it, the old timber? Yeah, anyway, so it's let's go down. Up here, Stephen. Hey? It's got some character and age up here. These are put in 1865, except for these two, uh, 1957, what my dad put in. So, pardon me, I'm out of breath, I've just been upstairs. This is the old ringing machine. So, what this did. If you didn't want to ring by help, Vicar Finch used to ring, used to uh, have this because he could do weddings without bells. So what happens is this motor turns that, which turns this pulley. There's nuts on here. There's a nut behind the camera called Dave Reed and all. But anyway, what happens is it pushes these down and these rods hit hammers on the outside of the bells. And that's what he used for weddings to save money. So there you go. All right, enough. Am I on? It's red. All right, Dave, I'm going to show you a bit of bell ringing. Go on, we don't do it with that. Though, no, no, hang on, wait, see this here? Yeah. This is called the spider. This is where you put the bell ropes, right? Now, this is the second bell. This is my dad's bell. That's that picture in, in uh, Tottenham, where I was standing on the box yeah, yeah, of the foyer. Yeah, yeah. Right, there's a bell rope, it's a tile end. This is called a sally. Now, sally? Sally. Now, before you ring a bell, that bell's down, look, because it swings. When you pull it up, so you take coils of rope, like this. Ready? Yep. Ready? Yeah, this has got my old man's name on it. Oh, the tile ends on. Look at that. Now that bell is up, upside down. And look, see this one here? Yeah. That's down, you can pull it. This one here, you know how you know it's up? It's hard. Because it's against the stay. You'd never go like that. Without, if you did that and thought the bell was down, you'd get a shock. 
you do it, that's how you turn the bellies down. And I can set this both ways. Watch this. I can I can uh, set it this way. This is hand stroke. Hang on. The rope's a bit long for me. That's backstroke. And then and because I can't check. Because How do you keep them ringing? Well, they, they ring well, right after all of them. Okay, when a bell, let me explain. If a bell, I'll do it, show you this way. If a bell just swings side to side, I'll do it, this is a treble, right? I'll do it, showing you the treble. I know this is down, because they're all down, because we've been up there. So, if you ring a bell, just swing it. swinging I can't control it. It swings side to side like a pendulum. Nothing I can do. Right, I can't change positions of other bells. I'll bring it down now, hold on. So what have I done that? I didn't look. Let's put it like that for a second. But because this bell is up, yeah, what I can do, I can change the time <coughs> of other bells. So I can go Hang on. I, I'm a hot, that's not set, I can hold it there. That's not set. So I can swap positions with other bells. So I can cut in on them like this. Or go further up. That's how you do train joining. Because they're upside down, and you can swap positions. Oh, I ain't got a clue what you're talking about. No, no. <laughs> anyway, what I'll do now, we've had enough. I'm going to bring it down, all right? Yeah. Then we can get out of here. In all these years, I've never been up there. Or I can chime it like this. That's chiming. That's chiming. Time is, that, is that when in the time of the day? Can you do that? So no. it's three o'clock, you go one, two. No, three. but that's done by a clock and a hammer. Oh. But I'm just, that bell's swinging and the clapper's just hitting the side. Oh, right. There you go. Great stuff. I learnt you something. Oh, is that talk? Great stuff. Right, See then. these though? What? These look new. Yeah, they probably are. Oh, you, you can change these? Yeah, no. they don't last forever. So here we are, this is St Anne's Road. And this is the, uh, here's a church. St Anne's, Stan oh, it's, it's, I think it's called St Anne's Tottenham, but it used to be St Anne's Stamford Hill, it was known as. Keep it out of there, Bellamy lives down there. No, no, uh, it's this below Road Library? Yeah, there, yeah. <coughs> well, library's still Is there. There's Weeds Piano still here, it used to be on the left. Weeds Piano? Blimey, I don't know, Dave. Yeah, it's there, look, still. Look, it used to be Piano Weeds. Factory. Jay Reed Piano is still is this well I don't think it is but it was yeah. I think it was they've kept that I only remember that because it's the same name Billy Clark's Road down there but there was two streets wasn't there there was yeah. one went off yeah Dave where are you I don't know if you're going to get around there yeah look Charlie Bart we used to call it Charlie Bartlett's Bridge there was a few shops there was a motor accessory place on the corner then there was a cobbler's, a little news agent's, a toilet's, then there was a greengrocer's and <coughs> a butcher's. Me and Woody used to climb up on that bridge and get the eggs. Did you? On the railway. So here we are, Seven Sisters Road.
cameras everywhere. I've got one. Greenfield Road, I used to walk, you could cut through there. My mates used to live in their mouths on the right. There used to be a what's name here, didn't there? A signal box, was it here? The Somewhere. signal box was over there. Was it? Yeah. Is that what's name is? Signal box, what's yeah. name? Yeah. Etchings, you, bike used to be over yeah, there. Yeah, I know. Dave Mackay's shop was here, the footballer's shop, footballer. Oh, I don't remember that one. That's a, anything to do with football is a what's her name shop as far as I'm concerned. Dave, Dave Mackay's shop was up here. Here we are, Seven Sisters Station. Used to be all shops there, and you could cut through the Tottenham High Road up yeah. that road. That's you could, yeah. You may still do, who knows? I don't think so. It's a lovely area, isn't it, Dave? There used to be a sorting, sorting office. Now, where was that? Is which road? Where was um, Dave Farris? McCoy, Dave McCoy's shop was this, where it says QE1 on it. Plus. Was that where Farris was? No, Farris. Farris is the next one. Up here on the corner of it. And then there was Ward's corner. Ward's stores was on the left hand side. Right. The Reek was on that. Corner. Yeah. Tottenham, eh? Who would have believed, eh? Oh. Dave Reed and Stephen, Jen, she's thinking, what did we come to this dump for? Yeah, that was, uh, I, I bought my Webley um, Mark III air gun there. To be honest with you, Steve, I can't actually remember the, uh, 